Welcome back to LA everyone. It is another day and today I'm going to be giving you some rapid fires, rapid fire do's and don'ts when it comes to Instagram. So, but before that, I need to change my clothes, uh, take a shower and uh, go capture some B-roll of me and my breakfast, my very, very boring breakfast. So let's go. I feel refreshed already, and that means it's time to go to the B-roll, uh, which, uh, yeah, let's go. That, that usually works, but uh, maybe I'm gonna have to like, I don't know, like, really put some effort in. breakfast off and all I've got is a pop tart to eat let's go back to my room and do the rapid fire reasons okay and we're back in the room and my light is totally in this frame oh my goodness one one second oh I'm actually uh, gonna change my shirt I decided I don't want to wear this one right now so uh, yeah let's go Feel much better now. <laughs> it's always nice. Oh wait, crap. Forgot to put my hat on. We gotta snap that puppy on too. Okay. See, look, now I got my hat on. I'm all good. Okay, it's time for my Instagram do's and don'ts in rapid fire fashion. So the first one is don't worry so much about everything. Like your likes and your followers and your comments and just everything, okay? The second one is post at your own pace because your pace is the pace that you should be going. You don't have to post every day, but you should be posting regularly each week, okay? Man, got this thing on me. Uh, the third one is earn your... F Wait a second. I just realized my light over here is in the frame too. Golly, what the heck, Zach? I thought everything was out of frame. Jeez. Third one. Um, Earn your followers, don't buy them, okay? Oh, and my personal favorite one is no more selfies. Let's get rid of those because those are stupid. We don't need to keep seeing everything. It's like we're so self-absorbed that we take pictures of ourselves all the time and it's like, we don't need that. Just like find something else, take pictures with a group and I'm cool with that, but like, come on, we don't need to keep seeing every post is just the same thing. It's like, it gets kind of old, I'm gonna be honest, okay? This is a new look. Anyways, find a purpose when you're doing this, okay? No more, okay, I gotta take this off. You can't even be serious about it. What the heck? Find a purpose behind what you're doing. Don't just do it for no reason. It's gotta, it's gotta have purpose and then people will actually like what you're putting out there and be like, wow, this is really cool, okay? Anyways, um, no more sob story, more more positivity, right? Like let's bring that into this. Let's it's just there's a way in which we hide in our in our social media accounts and that is one of the ways we just write our sob story on there and it's like people don't want to hear that on Instagram. They want to hear that from you in person if something's going on, okay? So make sure to do that if you're if you're doing that. I'm someone who's done that before, so and the last one <laughs> is get rid of Instagram. Just go hold your thing on your phone and be like, delete, you know, and just get rid of it. But if you have a purpose behind why you have Instagram, then elevate that purpose and be like, man, I can use this for good and positive things and make sure to do that for me. Could you? Yeah. Ooh, 
last one like that. Oh, woohoo! Anyways, so to touch on the last thing, it's not any of the rapid fire, but where is your worth? Like, where are you finding your worth? Is it in is it in the likes? Is it in the comments? Is it in the the views? Is it what what is it in? Like, let me know down in the comments where you find your worth when it comes to social media and the outlets like YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. No one uses Facebook here, probably. You're all too young for that. Um, that's where I'm gonna leave you. We're gonna go to the final end part where that bell rings. Let's go to it now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Back and back and back and back. I got my bucket hat on. Anyways, I am so grateful for you all and the fact that you watched this video means the world to me. So if you have not already, go subscribe to this channel. I look like a complete nincompoop and I'm okay with it. And hit the bell button if you haven't already. Get those notifications. Make sure to go comment below what I let you uh, told you to do and we'll see what we can come up with and just let me know what you thought about this video. Yes, it's been a great one. I hope you enjoyed all the cool transitions and B-roll. It's just uh, fun to create. So uh, yeah, I'll see you later. Go follow my Instagram and all that good stuff. And...